everyone. Welcome back to 30 Ink 30 Days. We are here on day two. That's four. Two. <laughs> September 2022. Uh, let's take a look at yesterday's ink, which was Tsutsuji by Pilot Iroshizuku. So this is my, like, ink studies. So my plan is to every time I ink up a pen... Do a line in here so I can see what it looks like in different pens. Um, what's really exciting is I'm finally getting to the point where I will have second entries in here for some of these. So on the, the this is a Cosmo Air light. You can see the gold sheen on here. And if we look at the um, Tomoe River paper here in this um nebula note you can really see that gold sheen um in these uh splats uh so that is yesterday's business and that was in again my venue grand supper let us move on and upwards to today's business i told you i was very prepared and i have picked out the inks and the pens and mashed them up for all 30 days. <laughs> Over the top? Yes. So today's ink is another ink by Pilot, Hiroshizuku. This one is Yamabudo. And I'm going to be putting it in. Look at that. That is a good match. Uh, this is my Lamy All Star in the vibrant pink. So. Let's go. I believe this is like translates to wild grapes. These bottles are gorge. Ugh, flying animal in here still. Um, and by a flying animal, I believe that it's a fly. Um, so. So again, doing my little syringe filling because it makes me feel like I'm doing science. But also it allows me to not fill a pen quite as full. Because we know I don't need 30 pens filled to the brim. Um, oh, I like that I can see the ink Going on up into the feed. Go on. I see you in there. Cool. Should be good. So, it's funny. Let's, so, uh, Tsutsuji was, gosh... Among, it's the first expensive bottle. No, that's not true. I think Emerald of Chivar was the first expensive bottle of ink I bought. But this was probably the second. And Yamabudo I fell in love with around the same time. But I was like, no, Maria, you don't need to spend that much money on ink. And so I bought another ink that was supposed to be like, oh, it's going to be just as good. But I had to get it. It's lovely. I mean, you know. Wait, what am I missing? Oh, we've got to do our thing. Um, so I have not yet edited the footage for a previous day. I'm really hoping that the video I made with the writing turns out well. What I didn't explain is that, maybe I did explain, that notebook that I made has um, three different types of paper in it. So kind of a lot of writing to do all at one time. Um, 
and I don't know that I will do that much writing at one time for any of the other. Whoo, whoo, juicy, <laughs> juicy, juicy. <laughs> Um, juicy pen. I told my coworkers that I went to the pen show the other day. You know, they asked me, did you get a pen? Of course I got a pen. I think that has dropped that. This is not going perfectly. I'll have to hold this one in. So, I drew that line too close to the bottom. Because you don't want the ink to go into the water. It will wash off. Possibly let this go longer, but I won't. Okay. I mean, the good news about me splitting the days like this is I can easily see what did I do the previous days. <laughs> It's happened already. It happened. No. <laughs> I like I it's just thrown me so much that I can't write like anything correctly now. <laughs> How many eyes are in the word ink, Maria? It's one. Thanks. Okay. Pen. I'm the all-star. Vibrant pink. Borad. Now we have to smoosh smash. over here oh my gosh why we're just made of struggling right now how about we do this oh because we're gonna maybe that'll help okay ready I'm glad I was paper down because it's covered in splatters. That feels good. I mean, the splatter feels good. The paper being covered with splatters feels good. It's glorious. This ink is so beautiful. So beautiful. It's like a, ugh, it's a dark magenta. So that's actually the first ink in here. And let's come over here and write. Oh. Mm -hmm. What day is it?
Look at that. Oh, juicy. And smooth. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Should we write the same sentence? Um... I guess so. My favorite pangram. Pack my box with five dozen liquor jugs. So um, I don't know that I'm going to show me doing the writing in my book, but I will show it off at some point. Ooh, look at, you can start to see the gold sheen already coming up over here. It to me looks more of an old gold than this. Um, Real quick while we're here, I will show you from yesterday, G. So this is, um, this paper is Tomoe River, uh, what is it, 68 GSM? This is, um, bank paper, the Yamamoto Mitsubishi bank paper. So this one I only wrote on one side of the page because the show through it is yeah. And then this is Cosmo Air Snow. So this is Cosmo Air Light. That's Cosmo Air Snow. Hopefully you can see the difference. This is a, a whiter um, paper. So you can see, as huge, um, the Cosmo paper making the line look more broad than the Tomoe River. The Cosmo is definitely amping up that sheen. These were all nice papers to write on um, yesterday with this pen and this ink. I did note my first experiments with this bank paper were with a fairly um, unlubricated ink, and I hated it um, with the pen I was using it. So it'll be interesting to see as we go through this book if there are days when I'm just like cursing my way through the one page of um, bank paper. So the way this book uh, is made, it's going to go like... Um, Tomoe bank paper, Cosmo Air Snow, then again Tomoe bank paper, Cosmo Air Snow, then the reverse order, Cosmo Air Snow bank paper, Tomoe River, because they're folded. So um, I hoped I really liked the bank paper because it's thin and it actually comes with the grain direction and proper um in the proper direction for book binding but i didn't like it anyway that is kind of like not related let's go back to 30 ink and this is almost dry now so we'll just think that that was intentional so here is our uh chromatography it does look like there's an element of this that might stick around and be waterproof. I'm not here to check that. I We all have the things that we have time for. This is not one I have time for. Or that I have the inclination for. Because I don't care. Uh, if my words are destroyed by water. Then so be it. Um, our glorious splat. Oh, this ink. I, wild grapes. Something like that. Um, I love it. So... These are definitely two of my favorite inks. Were they on my list? Remember I did that list of like 12 favorite inks? Tutsuji was on it.
but Yamabuto wasn't. But like looking at these, I already like want a bump opportunity to put to put Yamabuto on there. It's not fair. They're different inks, but right now, look at it. I'm in love. So anyway. Let me know if you think I forgot to show something in today's video and it'll be too late. I'll have recorded several more by the time I see your comments, but I will appreciate them nonetheless. <laughs> I hope you're all having a fantastic day. Bye.